Welcome back. Yeah, welcome back to Pixel Playground. Library. Let's see the library card. Go, they say camera adds five pounds. But in your case, it gave you blonde hair and a totally different face. Amazing! <laughs> Fantastic! Wow, what a great photographer. Oh, one last thing, you haven't saved your game. Save room's right behind you. Yeah, that's right. That's that. important. It's pretty late save game place. I did right? save the game since I started since I saved I talked to this guy before. Uh, Have fun on your journey! I'm gonna stand here and do nothing some more. Isn't that what everyone does? Or they walk back and forth. Yeah, walking back and forth is key. Yeah. This guy's shrugging his shoulders. Let's see that library card. Hmm, well, I'm getting deja vu. Welcome to school town, friend. There must be, like, <clears throat> one person that's in charge of all the idle animations. <laughs> and that's just, like, what he does. He does idle animations. Like, in, in this whole game? Or just in any game. And I'm sure the people who animate the rest of the character, like, you know, Matt, you probably do one person as the whole character. You're just in charge of one character? Yeah. Because you're already fiddling with it. I guess. I was just thinking, like, how many ways can you make someone idle? Like, a lot. Like, you can have them bend their knees. You can you have them... Sway. It really depends on the personality. Yeah, okay. Like, these guys, they get all creeped. They're like, hey, and they, like, move their whole, like... They do like, a little jig, like a macarena. Like, they're doing, like, a fucking <laughs> burp. little macarena. Hey, that was ignoring that. Because, it was, um, <laughs> because you know. it was silent and no one could hear it, except for me. Yeah, and you have to call me out on it. Yeah, because it's kind of weird. You just had a weird pause in the middle of your sentence. <laughs> well, I should pause more in the middle of my sentences because I speak really, really fast and I always try to slow down, but I always forget because I get excited about what so I'm going to say. You should just burp more often. Yes! Is what you're saying. It's like the, the bean song, except about burps. The bean song? Yeah. Did you not know, get that one when you were growing up? Or it was like, beans, beans are good for your heart. The more you oh. eat, the more you fart. The more you fart, the better you feel. So eat your beans at every meal. It's not really a song. It's a rhyme. Yeah. Or like a... I don't know. It's, it doesn't go to a tune. It did, it There's went no to, melody. There's a little bit of a melody. It's, it's like... Oh. It's all one note. Oh, they respawn? What? Do the enemies respawn when they go off screen? Yeah, that is a pretty quick respawn. Uh, I hate that. Oh! Oh, are you gonna get like a hover ability? I'm gonna probably get a better jump. Are you gonna get like a helicopter hair ability? Ooh, that would be cool. What like, did I just save a record of like your Donkey journey? <laughs> I got over here by putting down a whole bunch of skeletons behind me. Scarecrows, not skeletons, you know. I'm an old man. Leave me alone. And you can teleport, apparently. <laughs> Would you like me to take you with you, take you with me to the end of the game? Oh, he's got wings. Ah! Uh, Forgot he had wings. Ah! Uh, those wings look way too small for him. Now they really. And look now way he's too a small. skeleton. Now they're way too big for him because he doesn't need wings. He's dead. His skin instantly de decomposed. I'm a suck. I really love when enemies explode into a skeleton. It's like so satisfying. I like it when they just explode, in general. <laughs> And you're gonna love it when we kill bosses. Actually, no, I like it when they, like, puff into dust. Mmm. That's always cool. Oh, what was it? Um. I'm trying to think, there was one game I played recently that had a really satisfying, like, enemies turning to dust animation. And now I cannot remember. It's a game you played recently? Yeah. I mean, I don't know what games you play. I know you played Final Fantasy, but it's not that. Yes, it is Final Fantasy, oh, it actually. Is? The petrification kill is uh, super satisfying. I don't remember what that looks like. It's like they turn, you know, they turn to stone and then they, like explode into like just half dust, half like tiny shards. Uh, but it's like they explode like completely outward, so like, like you know, perpendicular to the skin. Right. They explode outwards, so they get like, you know, almost like they get bigger, and, but, you know, shattered. Right. Really, really awesome. Yeah, I like it when guys like shatter or like go into smoke. Mm hmm. You don't. Um. I think, that's, I think that's one of those things about like video game design that most people don't think about of like is how making things like feel satisfying. Yeah. Like, the designers do, but, like, people that aren't in the design process, like, don't realize, like, how many things come together to make it, like, awesome when you hit someone with the thing. Yeah. 
like all the shit that goes into something like um uh like god of war like even like one of these like crazy epic moments and like you know you're coming down on this giant boss and it's like the music and the camera angles and perspective and, and like the, the pacing and the speed and the not everything but the circle <laughs> pressing really but it's just like a, it's like an impressive amount of stuff that goes into just like even sound has a lot to do with that yeah and i think pacing too like the the feeling of speed that's a more that's a more like modern design uh trend yeah the Horror. speed to make it feel like you have like weight in your movement yeah exactly and i think actually those action games like god of wars were the first ones to really like do a crazy like a great job at that Ooh, a giant heart squid i'm sure there are others i just can't think of them right now because that's like pretty late in gaming history yeah oh fuss and frit squid baron you seem like down what's up man Oh, you know. He only has one tooth. Post boss syndrome. Now that you've embarked on a new adventure, I feel like I'm destined to become some kind of filler boss. I don't see chew anything. <laughs> I'm not sure I follow. You know, I was a major enemy last time, but uh, this time, I just feel like we're going to have to battle again, just to round out the package. Package? You mean like your eight packages down there? Oh my god, can you give them to me, please? <laughs> you wouldn't understand. He's so cute. So I need to get some way. Get away. Someplace warm. Maybe it's time for a vacation, Squid Baron. A change in perspective could do you... Oh, I was reading the wrong person. <laughs> that was... Say, are you mocking me? I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> you might be onto something. I've always had a fairly flat view of the world. Even though I'm a big, round, giant, purple, menacing octopus. He's got a little bit of purple on. He does. Didn't actually do that on purpose. I don't know why I said purple. <laughs> He's got yellow, too, and he's got a little white. <laughs> kind of stare at the same four walls, you know? Repetitive, high-stress music. I could use a change of scenery. <laughs> there you go! If you think of a good vacation spot, please, let me know. Aww. Meantime, I'm gonna cry in a corner. Aww. 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 Poor guy. What a bitch. <laughs> Ooh, go in the giant building. We'll get there. It's giant, though, and it's a building. <laughs> And it's giant. <laughs> I was like, I was like zoned out for like half a second, and I just like hear the word giant like eight times, in like my peripheral hearing. <laughs> just like giant, giant, giant. My vacation brochure is probably all soggy and gross. He dropped it down this drain. He's a terrible vacation brochure salesman. Yes, he is. We didn't get to hear his we didn't get to hear his story because I talked to the squid first. But uh... he's a vacation brochure salesman, but he has never actually left the town. Oh me, oh my, that blue-haired lad installed our new lock backwards, upside down and inside out. Does that make it right way? Upside down, no. It makes <laughs> it the opposite of right way. <laughs> now we're trapped inside without a royal gate key. Sob, sob. I always like the phrase, oh me, oh my. Oh me, oh my. Oh me, oh my. Oh my, oh me. Whoa. Yeah, royal sewer. Oh yeah. You didn't go into the giant building. I couldn't, it was locked. Oh, okay. I was paying attention. <laughs> oh, I got a flesh pop. That's flesh good. Flesh pop. Two flesh pops. That sounds appetizing. Three flesh pops. Ah, ah, ah. One, two, three flesh pops. And I'm gonna use one. Mmm, delicious so, flesh. Are you a cannibal or what? No, just random flesh, not like ah, human okay, flesh. not human flesh. Like snake flesh, maybe. What is that noise? It's the blocks breaking. That is a, it sounds like someone screaming. <laughs> <laughs> Are supposed to be snakes? Yeah, they're snakes. Nice. We know they're supposed to be snakes. They look exactly like snakes. So there's snakes in the sewers. There's actually just like real life. They only have one. Um, is that my fourth squid? Yeah, that's my fourth heart squid. Heart squid. That was fast. Yeah, man. You gotta, get, you gotta get the hearts up. That's way faster than Zelda. Oh, God. You gotta find your fourth heart piece like you're fucking like in Dungeon 4. Yeah. You have like no... Oh, shit. Hmm. Oh, it's a puzzle that we can't solve yet. I don't know how I feel about that like minus 5 that it shows every time you hit someone. Well, it increases. Well, I figured that, but... 
I don't know. This doesn't seem like the type of game that would have that. Oh, why, oh, why did I entrust such an important task to that incompetent, blue-haired youth? Oh, sobby sob sob. Yeah. Your hair is, is purple. Hmm. If only we could find a blue-haired youth. Ah. Uh. <laughs> hey, flesh pops! You got those for me? Um, no, I need to keep them for later. You Shoulder know. pad guy. Yeah, I found it out of my mouth an hour ago. He just, like, only works out his shoulders. <laughs> That's all he does. It's Dude. like someone that, like, only works out one arm, but he only works oh, out his shoulders. Oh, like masturbator. Yeah. Except he masturbates with his with shoulders. His shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a harness and everything. <laughs> oh, could it be? You have the royal gate key! I'm a poach and I don't even know it. You got mad at me for saying that joke last time. Yeah, but now I said it, so it's okay. Now it's okay. <laughs> Would you pass it through to me, please? No. Then all is truly lost. No. Yeah, we got the gate key. Ha! It is a thing of beauty. Now I can unlock this. Unfasten that. Reattach. And my pants are fixed. Second land palace is once again open to the public and my pubics. Please come inside. Is the only reason you said pubic because it's it looks like public? Yeah, and because I was talking about his pants. Ah, okay. Well, next time Pixel Playground, I'll kill this guy. Why well, you got a question? That was a joke with solid and on topic. 